What's up, everybody? It's your boy Steve from the Watch Corner, and today we're doing the Fraser and Co. Luminary. So let's go ahead and not yak anymore. It's getting nicer out. Coming approaching, we're in fall now, so I'm gonna start doing some reviews outside. Let's get this camera flipped around and get this thing started. All right, everybody, quick, quick wristwatch check. I'm we're rocking my brand new from Match Watches. I didn't do a video. Uh, this is the Invicta Pro Diver with the diamond dial with the open heart. An exhibition case back with the crown guard. I love it. I got a matching bracelet coming from Waverly Manly next week at the Jerome and OB Knock Breast Cancer Charity event, which we're hoping to raise $5,000 this year. So, yeah, check that out. You all know I, I don't like bling bling, but sub subtle, you know, subtle bling is okay. That's why I think this one's really cool on this nice rubber strap. I figured it's getting nicer out. Let's do the reviews outside. Okay, for the start of the show, I'm not going to go over all the specs because I did it in my unboxing and I'm trying to mix stuff up. Look at this beauty. This is the Fraser & Co. Luminary. Retails $550. Limited edition. Titanium case. Titanium case back. Absolute beautiful open heart movement. And I said in the unboxing, if you haven't watched it, go over there and watch it. That this is paying homage to the Hamilton Jazz Master, which had cutouts, the AP Tapestry, and the Richard Meal watches because of the square case. This is absolutely amazing with the gigantic sapphire crystal on it. I mean, that dial. Absolutely amazing. All those textures, like a waffle type red dial, it's amazing. Get better light doing it outside. I like the little bit of the cog wheel red on the screw down crown. Now, you know, the elephant in the room here is well, wait a minute, Steve, when you've done the unboxing, you had a blue dial one. Yeah, I did. But there was an issue with the crown and stem, and it kept starting and stopping, and it wouldn't stay running. They figured out what was wrong with it, but they sent me. I sent it back because I can't review a watch that's not working properly. And uh, they sent me this amazing, beautiful, beautiful watch with the red dial instead. Like I said, retail 550, limited edition. Um, you know, you get this beautiful cloth bag to keep it in. You know, the... Beautiful Fraser and Co. box. You get the owner's manual. You get the card on it. You can see you got the blue, you got the red, and the rose gold. Okay, winding the mainspring instructions. You have your challenge coin, which you all know Cameron was a military veteran. It's a military thing. Super dope. With the picture of the actual watch on it. You get the stainless steel gold plated warranty card. And remember, there's the best in the business. Five years. The industry standard is two behind it. You have the spring bar tool and the leather, which I showed in the unboxing. I'm not going to rip this one open. The leather deployment strap to match it. You get the wiping cloth. And then you get the case to put in when you're traveling, which I took my case with me when I was traveling. And maybe I'm just a doofus, but I couldn't figure out how to properly put it in the case right Unless I actually took the strap off of it. Uh, putting the strap on it wouldn't fit with the little latch closed all the way down. I mean, there's nothing. There's, you know, you got the uh, the pros and cons to this. I mean, it's a little expensive, yeah. 550 is a lot of money for this limited edition piece. It's worth every penny of it. You all know how much I love Cameron. He's a Marine Corps veteran. And for a job, he uh, rehabilitates people with traumatic brain injuries. He's my absolute hero. I love this guy. I love his watches. I'm sad. I wanted to keep this one and just do the payment plan, but I don't have the money right now. My overtime stopped. So, yes, I do plan on picking one up. I already told him that. It's absolutely beautiful. Um, I am going to pick one up. Just not right now. I got the quick release strap, and it comes with the leather deployment one, which is also amazing. I prefer the leather. I mean, the rubber over leather. Y'all know I'm a rubber strap or a stainless steel bracelet guy. I think it would be super cool, Cameron, if you're watching... If they would make um, black, I guess, IP coated or whatever you want to call it, PVD style stainless steel bracelets for these things, that would be awesome. I would love it. I would definitely buy one. And this is also the cousin to the visionary. Y'all know I picked one of them up. 
Uh, so I love it. There's no downside except for the price is a little bit pricey, but this is limited edition piece. And remember, all proceeds of his sales of watches, he, he, he takes a percentage towards charity, so that's super amazing. I definitely would recommend this watch if you want a super dope piece. I love the cutout. It's freaking amazing where you can see the watch works. Just amazing watch. Like I said, it's very similar to the Visionary, which is 475, but the Visionary don't have the cutout in the front. It's all skeletonized in the front. So I definitely recommend this watch. It's amazing. You know, I'm trying to switch up my videos. You know, I did all the specs and stuff on the unboxing. You know, I'm trying to just switch up things a little bit. I, I don't want to keep doing the same thing over and over again. I, you all know I try to be different. I'm not trying to copy other people. I'm trying to do my own thing. So, yeah, that's all I got for you all. And um, definitely I will put a link in the pinned comment. I will put a link to the website. Go check out his watches. They're beautiful. Definitely awesome watches. I love them. Cameron's an awesome guy with an awesome beard. And I'm glad that we, you know, got to know each other. And I'm always excited when I can review one of his watches. So that's all I have today, folks. The Ravens are spanking the hell out of the Tennessee Titans in London. So I figured, let me go take my five-mile walk and let me do my watch review. I absolutely love this. Like I said, I didn't do the unboxing on. I got a lot of charity stuff been going on. And um, just, uh, you know, with the beer club and with my watch group. And I love it. And as I say at the end of all my videos, please remember time is short. Let someone you care about know how much you love them. They have a great evening, folks. Thank you.